Canoe Electric Truck Meet the Canoe Electric Pickup Truck Canoe's EV platform incorporates all the essential parts of an electric powertrain with space-saving technologies. Canoe's thin platform with no need for an engine compartment allows the company to offer a flatbed size comparable to America's best-selling pickup truck on a smaller footprint. This vehicle comes with some pretty amazing extras as well. There's a cargo storage area in the front of the vehicle that folds down into a workbench, which is very handy for contractors on the go. It also has a new slide outside step and storage area towards the bed of the truck. The pickup bed has so many uses, folds down into a workable table, there's a power outlet located back there. It also has a modular design which allows you to customize the space and separate items as needed for transport, and it has a two-foot extension that permits more capacity. With an additional roof rack, there seems to be no end in how much you can hold. It also boasts up to 600 horsepower and 550 pound-feet of torque with dual motors. The truck can carry up to 1,800 pounds, and the electric battery gets approximately 200 plus miles of range. Nikola NZT Here we have the new Nikola NZT Utility Task Vehicle, or side-by-side, -side, and it may be unlike any you've seen before. This four-seater off-road all-electric vehicle features up to 590 horsepower and up to 770 feet-pounds of torque. Electric motors are no longer the slow movers they once were, as this vehicle can go from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 4 seconds. A full battery will take you approximately 150 miles before a charge, and the DC quick charge can get you back out in about 2 hours. For off-roading adventures, the Nikola NZT is waterproof and the driver can submerge the NZT in water up to 1 meter for 30 minutes, allowing peace of mind in wet or muddy conditions. With four independent motors, one at each wheel, the E-axles integrate inverter, gearbox, and E-motors all in one and are what makes staggering performance benchmarks possible. Bollinger B1 and B2 These USA-built Bollinger trucks are the only Class 3 electric trucks on the planet. The B1 and the B2 by Bollinger are all-electric, all-aluminum, and have all-wheel drive. The B1 has a more typical utility truck look to it, similar in style to Hummer or even Jeep. The specs on this four-seater vehicle are impressive, holding up to 5,000 pounds of load and 7,500 pounds of towing capacity. With a 142 kilowatt battery pack, the B1 can get 200 miles and its dual motor, one front and one rear, have 614 horsepower and 668 feet-pounds of torque and reaches top speeds of 100 miles per hour. The B2 is the electric pickup truck and big brother to the B1. Bollinger says it has twin DNA and is the same inside and out, so the specs are identical, except the long bed mullet haircut. The B2 is capable of carrying 16-foot cargo through a patented full-length pass-through. With the rear seats out, you can transport a hefty stack of 4x8s with the tailgate closed. Chevrolet Colorado ZH2 Not wanting to miss out on the action is GM's Chevrolet Colorado ZH2, teamed up with the military to create this extreme off-road capable fuel cell powered electric vehicle. Built on a stretched mid-size pickup chassis and reinforced inside and out, the ZH2 rides on 37-inch tires and a specially modified suspension that helps the vehicle climb up and descend all manner of terrain. The Colorado ZH2 features an exportable power takeoff unit EPTO, that allows the fuel cell to power activity away from the vehicle. This one is still under development with the military testing it, and specific specifications are hard to come by, but we do know the Army will be looking into testing for near-silent operation enabling silent watch capability, reduced acoustic and thermal signatures, high wheel torque at all speeds via electric drive, low fuel consumption across operating range, and water byproduct for field uses. Creasel Hummer H1 Are you ready for this? Hummer has now gone electric. 
Well, at least for Arnold Schwarzenegger. Teaming up with Chrysler Electric, the Hummer H1 is equipped with high-performance batteries featuring a 100 kilowatt capacity and two electric motors on the front and back axles, with a system output of 360 kilowatts, 490 PS. The vehicle can reach speeds up to 120 km per hour and has a range of about 300 km and a total weight of 3,300 kg. With the original gas guzzler getting around 10 miles per gallon, the electric conversion will eventually pay for itself in fuel cost alone. Chrysler Electric has said they will not be mass producing the model, but maybe if enough of us ask, they'll actually put something on the market. Audi AI Audi is also getting into the off-road arena with their AI Trail. It combines futuristic design, autonomous driving, and electric mobility to offer an entirely new ride. It is built from aluminum, with carbon fiber and steel buggy features, level 4 self-driving hardware, and all-electric drive. AI Trail's lithium-ion battery pack is good for around 250 to 310 miles, though overlanding on rough surfaces can drop that figure to 155 miles. This ultra-sleek off-roader also features four electric motors to yield a total of 740 pound-feet of torque. Even the interior is innovative with airy and hyper-modern style, seating up to four with front shell-like chairs and rear hammock-like seating and enclosed in glass for panoramic views. Chrysler Electric G-Wagon When Chrysler is not outfitting the Hummer to go electric, they are working on other brands like this G-Wagon and once again for the famous Austrian and Californian. Schwarzenegger himself owns the first electric G built by Chrysler, a 482 horsepower SUV with an 80 kilowatt battery pack granting 190 miles of range. This version of the G-Wagon accelerates from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 5.6 seconds, 3 seconds faster than it had before because without the gas engine, it's about half a ton lighter. The battery itself has regenerative capacities, meaning it recharges when the car is going downhill or stopped at an intersection. Although it's not on the market anywhere for purchase, the innovations Creasel is showing here will outfit future models and hopefully provide us all more options in the future. Odyssey 21 Extreme E Next, we step into the world of off-road racing with the Odyssey 21 Extreme E, a fully electric SUV. In order to withstand the harsh conditions of racing in extreme conditions, the car's peak 400 kilowatt output is capable of firing the 1,780 kilogram, 2.3 meter wide ESUV from 0 to 62 miles per hour in 4.5 seconds at gradients of up to 130%. This vehicle is a truly collaborative project with spark racing technology components, a battery provided by Williams Advanced Engineering, which is encompassed by a niobium reinforced steel alloy tubular frame, as well as crash structure and roll cage. The tires, the vehicle's crucial connection to these terrains, are designed especially for the extreme conditions by founding partner Continental Tires. Designed to withstand the extreme temperatures, conditions, and terrains, the batteries will produce a maximum power output of 470 kilowatts, equivalent to approximately 630 brake horsepower. Rivian R1T This stylish and modern electric pickup truck, the R1T by Rivian provides all the comforts and luxury of a high-end pickup truck with the toughness and capabilities of the best off-road vehicles. The interior has vegan leather seating, Wi-Fi capabilities, and a stunning panoramic roof so you never miss the sights when you're exploring. Built with safety in any situation in mind, the R17 is made from aluminum alloy, ultra-high strength steel, and carbon fiber. Its low center of gravity helps prevent rollover and keeps you confidently planted, and it can drive through 3 feet of water or rock crawl at 100% grade. The quad motor inside can get the driver from 0 to 60 in about 3 seconds, proving you can race like a sports car in an electric-powered off-road truck. This vehicle also can tow up to 11,000 pounds of cargo, and there is a ton of storage between the bed, front truck, rear storage bin, undersea compartments, center console, and gear tunnel. There are over 68 cubic feet of storage. Solutions for every usage. Mercedes EQC 4x4 
Known for luxury, you can expect the Mercedes EQC 4x4 to be a step above. They have taken the pure electric EQC and dropped it on some terrain-friendly portal axis, making the vehicle off-road friendly. Right now, this vehicle is only in concept, so there are not too many specifications listed, but being that it's based on all-wheel drive EQC 400, it gets 402 horsepower from its two electric motors. Some of the technical highlights include the multi-link portal axles as well as the production of a powerful sound in the interior and exterior. We shall see if these move any closer to commercialization soon.